Indiana's a good ball club. Second place in the Big Ten right now. High fastball. Swing and a miss through that one. 93 at the letters. Batter to strike out in the country. 1-2 for McClure. He gets him here. Last place. As this one is lined to left center. Seidel will take it on a high hop. And holding McElfatrick at second base. And it's a ball in the turf. Kaiser can't find it. Here comes the runner from third, and he'll score. Real baseball stirrups out there. The 2-2, swing and a miss this year, a batter. And the 3-1 here is a breaking ball to center. And racing in is Arnone, and he can't make the play. There's contact between him and the right fielder, Kaplan. The ball falls. Seidel trying to stretch it to second, and he's going to be tagged out there. But the run comes across for the Panthers. Purdue Fort Wayne does not have a non-conference game scheduled this week. As this one is laced to left center. This is going to get down for Chapman. Arnone cuts it off. Chapman digging for two. The throw off line. And Aaron has a two-out double here in the sixth. Adding 197 as he rifles one off of the pitcher Souser. It ricochets towards the Panthers' dugout. Here comes Chapman all the way from second base to score. As he works from the wind, and the pitch. Breaking ball, and a beauty. And the pitch is driven to right, off the bat of Olenek, and deep. Back goes Kaplan at the track, at the wall. He can't make the play, it's off the wall. Look at Olenek go. He's around second, he's around third. Duffick's gonna send Olenek, and it's an inside the park home run for Ty. Well, that's one way to get an insurance run in the eighth inning. Let's see what they go with here. The kick in the 3-2. Another fastball drilled to left. This is trouble. This is deep. This is gone for Griffin Arnone. And it's a 3-2 ball game now as Arnone goes the other way. Comes set just below the belt. Throw to first, and he threw it wide of Jimenez. And down the right field line goes the baseball. Pinkston's going to turn second base. Here's the throw all the way to third. It's not in time. And the tying run now 90 feet away. Well, they, they may check on second. Did he touch second base? Oh, he missed second base. Oh, my goodness, on the appeal. The third base umpire, the umpire in the middle of the diamond. It's two balls and two strikes now here on the batter, McMackelfatrick, who swings and misses. What a finish to that one. What a bizarre ending to this game. You go from the heightened stress and anxiety of the would-be tying run at third base only to appeal that he missed second on a throwing error. He's called out for missing the bag. And then the next pitch swung on and missed by Owen McElfatrick. And the Panthers have beaten Northwestern.